This Despro tutorial video shows you how to create a waxering model using the Despro.cam software and the Magic 7 CNC milling machine made by Red Technology. Many jewelers nowadays use CAD CAM to create their wax models. Steps in this process involve a manual sketch, 3D CAD model, wax model, cast in metal using the lost wax method and of course the final result. We will focus on the step from CAD model to wax model, digital manufacturing. This can be done in two ways, either by adding wax, which is done on a 3D wax printer, or by removing wax, which is done on a CNC milling machine. This video is about CNC machining. We were happy that the Dutch reseller Bijou Modern welcomed us to shoot this video on their Magic 7 machine. We'll use this simple ring design as we want to show the most basic way of wax ring machining. A wax tube which is machined while rotating on the machine's rotary axis. The inside diameter of the ring needs to be created later using manual tools. For more advanced CNC technology see our other jewelry videos. First step in the process is to create the NC toolpath using Desproto. As you will see this is a very easy process as you will be guided by one of the wizards. We use a custom one of the custom wizards, the one called 4-axis wax ring. However, before I start that I want to cancel it first to check a few things. First, uh, our Magic 7 needs, uh, machine needs to have been selected. You can check that in the default part parameters. And here indeed the Red Magic 7 has been selected as your default machine for all new projects. So that's okay. The second detail is in the preferences indeed. Uh, millimeters have been selected as measurement unit as this wizard doesn't work on inches. Okay, and a third thing, thing I want to show you is in the library of cutters. We have added a cutter sold by Magic and this is this cutter the V cutter T40 V20 we've meet, made this definition so if you cannot yet find it in your desk proto you can uh, select a conic with a flat tip with these details to have that machine to have that cutter available for you okay back to the start screen where we just were and in the start screen we again use the custom wizard and now we select a 4 axis wax ring here it is outside of the view but I'll shift it aside a bit to have more uh, to see more in a moment so first thing is to load the geometry I want to use a sample ring the sample ring with a small stone in it it will open the STL file and show it you see it's a very simple ring with one uh, stone and four prongs. We're gonna machine that one. Okay, next uh, here's a small check. The blue cube should be in the center of the ring and the uh, cylinder wax block should be nicely around, with, aligned with the ring. If anything is not correct here you should go back to your uh, CAD package and change the SEL file. However, oh, however all is okay now so we proceed. Uh, we use a wax tube and uh, important details for Desproto are the uh, inside and outside radius of the tube. The inside uh, diameter is 15.6, so as a radius I enter 7.8. Outside diameter is 27.6, so as a radius I enter 13.8. Okay, next here you see the wax tube uh, along the ring. Uh, okay, next is the cutter. Uh, this magic one where here at the bottom, it's alphabetically, so here is the M. And as a precision, so as a distance between the tool path for finishing, I select roughly one tenth of a millimeter. Okay, next one. Uh, I want to use a roughing operation first. That's probably will automatically create that in the tree here in a moment. Uh, next, is it here? Yes, you see roughing and finishing. 
okay a skin a roughing skin so two tenths of a millimeter which will later be removed during finishing a layer height i do not want the cutter to go more than three millimeter inside the wax in one go and for roughing i have about a quarter of a millimeter uh, toolpath distance next i can calculate the toolpath as you can see it goes rather quick and again next and we are at the end of the wizard uh, I need it says I need to save the NC file in a moment but first we can uh, zoom in on the ring a bit see when I switch off roughing I can see the finishing tool path and when I switch off finishing I can see the roughing tool path so it goes down in two layers one two and as you'll see a bit of wax will remain present as otherwise of course during machining the uh, ring the wax model will fall out of the machine okay all is okay roughing and finishing and as a last step I write the NC program file uh, I call it uh, test ring it has the extension dot dat as red magic needs dot dat files the file is saved and now we're all, we are all set to go to the milling machine Want die slip, uh, ja, kan dat ding erop? Nee, dat is ook Ja, ik leg daar het klanten, dit kataan is ook op de party. Manufacturer Red Technology supplies a program called NC Spooler uh, for their magic machines. It's a free download. Start the program, uh, grant permission, and it will automatically find the correct COM port for your machine. It will not, however, automatically set the correct baud rate, so you need to enter the tool menu uh, and set the correct about rate here 115,200 otherwise it just won't work okay now we're ready to open the NC file that we just created in desk proto open we can select it and uh, finally after a thorough check if the machine indeed is ready to start machining we can say transmit select it